So we're going to do the recap for the pendulum workshop here at Ignite. And so basically it was the pendulum. This is the basic pendulum, the swinging from side to side. And we explored controlling the pendulum just as it swings, trying to get it to this solid horizontal line. And then trying to explore in space, have you, can you keep the control? Can you keep making a line wherever you can reach? And so we did that in the, wait a minute, <laughs> let's do it. Uh, that was the first exercise. And then we were just having a look at the pieces. So the basic pendulum and then the extendulum. So the pendulum with an extension and then Pendulums could be linear, between lines, or you can explore the space however you like with the pendulums. Okay, so, and then there was the isolated pendulum. And the isolated pendulum, you try to move around the poi head. We learned this one. And then, oh yeah, you also had it where you could isolate around the, the center of the string rather than around the head. And we had the weird uh, isolated anti-spin cat eye tick-tock thing. So it's like uh, at the top of the pattern it's an isolation and the bottom it's an anti-spin. But the hand always moves in a circle switching sides each time. Um, so th those were a bunch of the pieces. And then if we put them together, we ended up with uh, a bunch of different variations. So let me give a couple of them. So basically taking any of the pieces and combining it together with any other piece in all of the timings and directions. So for example, if I just had a circle, and I added uh, the isolated pendulum, I'd end up with this pattern. So you get these different effects as it lines up with the, with the different uh, circles in the different timings and directions. So with anything, if you find something, you uh, go and see if it works with all the timings and directions. So this is like, um, air or same time opposite direction and then we had with the pendulum that was the other variation where we did a pendulum and then an extension to come back so it's kind of like a, a pendulum cap going back and forth the arm so yeah then we could go through all the timings and directions so if we go um, same time, same direction, earth, we get this pattern, the different ones. And then split time, same direction, water. So you get a different effect. And then split time opposite direction, the fire, you got this sort of effect. So anytime. So then anything in any timing and direction combines together with anything else of the same timing and direction. So you have a move that you're doing in one timing you can fit in the same pattern into it, in theory. <laughs> yeah. Something like that. So yeah, take all the pieces, combine them together with all the other pieces, put them all the timings and directions, and um, see what comes out. Oh.